Sap Neocon here with Blackbook Properties and CondoBlackbook.com. We are here at the gorgeous sales gallery of the gorgeous project called Rivage Ball Harbor Residences. Of course, in Ball Harbor, beachfront, boutique, waterfront living, ultra luxury and privacy. And I'm here with the wonderful Rita Collins, the sales executive here at the Rivage Ball Harbor. Thank you so much for having us today. Thank you for coming. Rita, what do people need to know about Ravage? Who is this for? Why is this the right project for them? Wow. So Ravage is an uber luxury building. It's very boutique. It's only 25 stories with 56 homes. People that are looking for the luxury of luxury, but they don't want necessarily a hotel as part of their home. They want to have privacy. They want to have the amenities. They want to have the services, but they want the quiet. That's our buyer. In a city like Miami, well, this is Ball Harbor, but in the Miami area, you have all these big skyscrapers, hundreds of units. What I love about Ball Harbor and Rivage is that there's height limits that makes the buildings more boutique. And then beyond that, the developers of Rivage have really chosen to make this even more private by having it uh, two to three units per floor, correct? Yes. So I don't know if anybody knows about Bell Harbor, but going back to the 50s and 60s, Bell Harbor has always been known as the most glamorous part of Miami. It's one square mile of beauty. The beaches are unbelievable. They are quiet. They're private. So it's a very exclusive area. And it's always been known to movie stars and presidents and senators going back to when we really launched back in the early 40s and 50s. So Bell Harbor is an exclusive area to begin with. With Bell Harbor shops right across the street, right? Well, that's the enhancement. That's the glory of our area also. It's one of the only commercial parts of the city other than the hotels which drive the people to the area. Absolutely. So describe a little bit the location within Bell Harbor for the Ravage. So Ravage is located on the ocean in Bell Harbor. We are the third tower from the inlet. So we're on the northern end of Bell Harbor, 102nd Street. Our property is unbelievable. We are 25 stories and only 56 homes. So we are an uber boutique building with a high level of amenities. Very unusual for South Florida to have a boutique building, especially in the beach in general. Correct. Let's talk a little bit about the development team of Ravage. This is like a who's who of ultra luxury development and design. Let's talk about that. Rivage came to fruition and was designed for many, many years in the planning. Two Roads Related Group are the developers. They saw Bell Harbor as the gem and the cream of the crop of Miami, and they put together an idea of what Bell Harbor should be always. Uber luxury, pristine, the buyer who wants the walkability to the shops, to the restaurants, but they also want a lifestyle of being in a quiet location. Bell Harbor's ocean and beachfront is second to none. It's exclusive. For our buyers, that's important to them. A lot of them are looking for anonymity as they can go to buildings with a hotel, but here we don't have a hotel, but we still offer the same type of services, the five-star service that they're looking for. Let's talk about the architect, interior designers, and so on. Wow, what a team. So we have SOM out of Chicago. They're most well known for doing the World Trade Center in New York City. They did the Burj Khalifa in Dubai. Incredible, incredible architects. Along with Rotet Studio, Lauren Rotet is an icon. She's known all over the United States for key projects that she's done from Four Seasons to the St. Regis in Aspen. I mean, she's phenomenal. And then as far as the landscape architect, which kind of brings it together with the landscaping, you have Enzo and Nia from Switzerland. The team is just incredible. We couldn't ask for a, be a better team. You can tell by looking at the building and the renderings, I mean, it is going to be a one-of-a-kind project, beautiful, understated elegance, modern organic design. We're very excited about what's to come here. Um, let's talk a little bit about the units themselves and some features that really stand out. So Lauren Rotet put together an incredible, incredible team for this project and the design work from the amenities all the way up into the apartments were hand selected. So we have Moteni kitchens, we have beautiful stones on the countertops, wolf appliances, gas stoves, all of these things just really bring the project to life. Our bathrooms come completely turnkey with the mirror work and the lighting already included. What makes us unique 
is that everything is very well designed, put together, and at closing you're ready to move in. That's something unique that we never had back in the day. Everything was decorated already, but with us, Lauren Rotet has put together options and choices that our very selective buyers can choose from, whether it's a light wood, a dark wood, you have stone options, our flooring, you can do wood or marble. It's incredible with the choices that we have, but what's beautiful is that they're moving into a very detailed, elegant home. Absolutely, I mean, all the closets will be done with uh, Molteni, the kitchens will be uh, complete, of course, the, the flooring will be complete, and they'll have been able to make the property their own through these selections and have the convenience of not having to deal with another six months of construction and renovations and design work and so on after closing. You're absolutely right, but to add to that, where we're different, not only do we add in the drop ceilings with all of the extra hi-hats already done, but our closets are completely finished also by Moteni. You're getting the best of the best, even in our bathrooms. Not only do they come finished, but the mirror work and the lighting is already done. The level of finishes that we're offering is unlike any other project in Miami right now. The ceiling heights are 10 feet across the board, which is amazing. The balconies, they're 12 feet in depth. Wow. And the way they design the balconies is that they're set inside so that you're not getting the wind. So it's a very beautiful, usable space, which is very important, which people don't really recognize that until it's too late. Absolutely. So let's talk about a little about the amenities. One of the standout amenities for me, I'm a racket sports kind of guy, is you guys have Padel. This is gonna be one of the very few projects in South Florida that has Padel facilities in the building. For anyone who loves racket sports and loves the, the new um, upscale uh, sport of Padel, I think that's gonna be a great touch. But let's talk about what else are key features of the amenities here in, in the building. So our building has over 22,000 square feet of amenities for only 56 homes. So not only do you have the pickleball and Padel, but we have a morning sun pool, we have an afternoon sun pool. We have three full bars inside the complex. So you have one inside the restaurant, one by the Western pool, you have a beautiful lounge inside the lobby as one of the standalone amenities. You have a gorgeous spa, which not only has treatment rooms and steam room and sauna, but we have a beautiful hammam. We have the hot and cold plunge pools. There's a beauty salon where you can have your hair washed and blown out, a separate room if you'd like to have your makeup done. We have a manicure pedicure room and we have a full on fitness center with the top of the line equipment Pilates room, yoga area, it goes on and on, including a golf simulator. Let's talk a little bit about the floor plans and the units. Um, you, you know, this is a boutique project, uh, a little over 50 units. Uh, what is the setup? What is the layout? What kind of sizes are we talking about? So from the second to the 17th floor, we have three homes per floor. We have oceanfront, four bedrooms facing the north side and the south side. And then we have a beautiful bay view from the west which is our entry level, 3,300 square feet. It's a three bedroom. And what we're finding is that our buyers are putting those homes together. So we have buyers that are doing a four and a three together and making a beautiful floor plan out of that. So our buyers that are looking here right now, typically are shrinking the size of the building by putting units together. One of the things that's uh, wonderful about Ball Harbor is that on the west side, uh, you have single family homes and the mall, which is what, two, three stories, right? Three stories. Basically your views, whether you're facing direct ocean or you're going to the west or north views, they are extraordinary, right? You have you have haul over cut there. Two out of the three units will, will have views of the haul over cut. You're looking at beauty all over the place. And because of the way the building's architected, no matter what floor plan you're in, you're gonna get ocean and bay. So I wanna welcome you into our beautiful show kitchen. So this is showing you the beauty of what you will find in the delivery of Rivage. You have this incredible kitchen by Moteni. So you have options. You can have the light wood. We also deliver it in a dark wood, which is beautiful as well. We have a full Sub-Zero refrigerator and a full Sub-Zero uh, freezer. But what I love most about our kitchen is not only the Wolf appliances, which are the best of the best, mm -hmm. But the amount of storage that they've designed in this kitchen, it makes it very usable space. 
For somebody that's a chef or likes to entertain, it's absolutely stunning. From a family standpoint, I could see my family gathering around here, having a breakfast in the morning or having lunch together, and uh, it just being a really welcoming open space for them. You have a convection steam oven, you have the beautiful brand new speed oven, which is top of the line, delivered by nobody else. And then you also have the microwave and coffee. I have a feeling that if my wife was here, she would be using that espresso machine every single morning. Let's not forget the wine closet. Mm -hmm. Essential to every home. And this comes as a standard feature. Wonderful. And uh, the stone, do we have options on the stone? We do. This is one of the choices. We have another one that's less veiny and more white and gray, the calicata. And I noticed that you have the, uh, the water spout right there for the chefs of the world. We have the pot filler, which comes standard, which is beautiful by design. But not only that, but we offer the pendant lighting as a standard feature. And that comes in different finishes and, and different colors. Why don't we go look at the bathroom? Let's go. As we're passing here, I can also show you our beautiful midnight bar which comes in all of the master bedrooms and all of the floor plans. It comes with a refrigerator, sink, and fluted glass. The details are... Wonderful. Is that, is that rose gold or what, what am I looking it's at? It's a champagne gold color champagne gold. by Dornbrock. Very nice. Now we're in the master bathroom and you can see the beautiful finishes. You have the travertine on the walls, the travertine on the floors, beautiful marble that lines the vanities. You have an option of the lacquer here in the white that you see, or also a dark color. I love the white marble accent that down there. Uh, so you not only have the LED lighting, but you have that accent to kind of bring out. It's showing you the level of finishes that we're delivering. You can also see the beautiful the sunken tub, which is exceptional in the marble. And then in the shower, you have double shower heads. And in the master, you have a steam shower as a standard feature but you also have these beautiful doors which gives you privacy, which are fluted glass as well. So now we're in the closets and as you can see, they're designed by Moteni. You can have a choice of the dark, you have a choice of the light wood, the vanity comes standard. And of course, plenty of room for the shoes. Shoe closet <laughs> is a must. So of course, here's my favorite padel courts right here, which is wonderful. And then this is pickle, correct? That is the pickleball, yes. Okay, wonderful. So it's an exclusive pickleball court there. And then we have the West Pool here. But when you say West Pool, you have to explain that in Miami, the sun rises in the east and wraps around to the west. This is where you spend your afternoons because a lot of places you lose your sun on the ocean. So to have a Western pool is very unique. There's, there's only a handful of buildings that offer that in Miami. But you still also have the wonderful pool that's overlooking the ocean and the beach. Which is exceptional. And uh, of course, your private pathway to the beach and beach service, which we can't forget, right? We have beautiful beach service. We have towels, chairs, and umbrellas, people to bring food and service out onto the ocean. But most importantly, which is important to me as a Bell Harbor resident, is our walking path. So Bell Harbor has a walking path, which takes you from 103rd Street all the way down to 1st, contiguous. So you go all the way down so, to the south, southern point of South Beach, South yes. Point Park. So it's, it's like having an outdoor amenity. I'd also like to point out, which is very important to our building, this beautiful sense of entry up to the Portica Share. So in a lot of areas of Miami, the buildings are located right on Collins Avenue. Here you have this tremendous setback. So that gives you all that you need to know. You have a beautiful drive up, you have the setback from Collins Avenue, you have all of these Western amenities before you arrive to the building, and another beautiful feature, which I can honestly say nobody else has. If you'd like to park yourself, which a lot of car enthusiasts do, you can go into the garage and park your own car in your own private garage. Every home comes with a private garage with a door. It's yours, it has two spots, and that comes with every home. I'm glad you mentioned that because that is a key feature. Clients call and say, I don't want anyone touching my car. Exactly. Why I have control over it. And certainly they don't want anyone banging their car uh, who's next to them in their, for example, assigned spot. Here you have your own private garage. Exactly. Exclusively yours, locked, and with the storage right behind it as well. Yes. So you have, uh, you have the best of everything. 
Rita, you've been in Bell Harbor for quite a long time now, correct? I've lived here for 25 years. 25 years, so no one knows Bell Harbor better than Rita. What excites you the most about today's Bell Harbor and where it's going? So in my opinion, you have to look where you came from to know where you're going. Mm -hmm. So Bell Harbor has always been this incredible one square mile of beauty on the ocean, on the bay. So this was always the hub for all of the glamour coming out of New York way back when. So it still holds that today, except we're growing as a community. So we have the Ravage coming in, we have the expansion of Bell Harbor Shops, which is adding more beautiful stores and beautiful restaurants. Everything is walkable. You have access to our new community center, which is just open this year. So you have a beautiful area where you have basketball courts and a children's water park and a drop for your paddle boards. So it's growing as a community in the best way possible. Now, drum roll, what everyone wants to know is what pricing are we talking about and when and what's the construction timeline? Our entry level home is right around $9 million and we go up all the way to the penthouse which is over $60 million. Our penthouse is absolutely stunning. It's a three-story penthouse, has its own swimming pool, over 12,500 square feet of incredible detail. That's our gem in the sky. I can't wait so, to take a look at it. Yeah, we're very excited about that. So groundbreaking is going to be summer of 2024, and our completion date is, is scheduled for the end of 2026, beginning of 2027. Excellent. Well, it's going to be an amazing addition to the skyline of Bell Harbor. I can't wait to visit it when it's finished. And of course, hopefully we can uh, do some deals together here with I'm some so looking great forward buyers. To it, but I have to correct you. Mm -hmm. It's going to redefine Bell Harbor. All right, let's redefine Bell Harbor then. Let's do it. Rita, thank you so much for your time. My pleasure. Uh, if you guys have any other questions about this project or Bell Harbor or condos in general in the greater Miami area, we're here to help you, condoblackbook.com. Feel free to reach out anytime. Have a great day.